everybody. Time Metalhead Weatherman here. Hopefully everyone's doing well. Uh, it's been pretty quiet on the weather side of things. And, well, some of you are bored. I can understand why. I know some of you are into the more intense weather. But we've been kind of on a slow trend right now. And as we look towards the weekend, and that's what mainly this video is going to be designated towards. Not really a lot to go on here. Uh, mainly going to be most interested in the activity over towards the Gulf Coast where even though this tropical disturbance which has actually even been labeled Invest 90L has a 0% chance of developing it's still going to bring rain across this region nothing incredibly crazy wouldn't even expect severe weather out of this from the looks of it right now maybe an odd water spout might sneak on the shore or something but at the most i'm just going to expect some occasional tropical downpours and that's really going to be it nothing too far out of the ordinary here nothing else in the tropics really pressing right now in the short term longer term we'll talk about that more tomorrow but even then that's kind of more or less uh, hearsay at this point because We've had storm systems get up to about 60 plus percent chance of developing and nothing happens. So a little bit, uh, a little bit questionable as to what could lie ahead there. But as far as this weekend is concerned, do have the marginal risk here. Not expecting much out of that. Main threat is wind and hail. Tornado threat is less than 2% in all areas. And, not, and it's pretty much kind of verified as a quiet day here, really. Three wind reports, one hail report. Storm activity still ongoing, but already going to be diminishing and heading out of that marginal risk area soon so again not really expecting a whole lot out of today and then the following days no severe weather threat expected so that's what our weekend is going to look like as far as our upper level setup is concerned just really not conducive for severe weather at all at the moment the temperatures out to the east in particular have been really nice you can see the ridging that's going on out towards the west right now and that's going to be the dominant pattern over the course of the next week or so actually so that being said not really not really much anything going on even the weather pattern itself is kind of zonal at this point maybe towards this end here maybe there could be more chances for stronger storms possibly over towards the ohio valley i wouldn't ex again i'm not really expecting too much to come out of that not really much in the way of forcing available to get those storms to kind of take off here so to speak so again just really a weekend where we're going to be relaxing temperatures are going to be pretty nice for a lot of us unless you're over towards the rockies and out west it's still going to be pretty warm but you can see here as we get to tomorrow over towards the southeast the 80s are going to be mainly confined to florida and parts of the southeast here up into the set a lot of uh mid to upper 70s here are actually starting to show themselves more less 80s more 70s we like what we're seeing here fall is coming folks and then of course out towards the west right now we still have those 100 degree temperatures even a few hundred teens possible over here but as we continue to go forward through the rest of the weekend it's just going to be what i would consider to be a pretty nice weekend overall for most of us there is some notably hot temperatures in particular over here towards the northwest over towards parts of utah heading all the way up towards idaho and then even towards washington and of course we already know about southern california and the southwest so no real surprises there and then of course we head into monday morning we might have some notable record notable low temperatures not record i would say but definitely chillier than what we're used to seeing here We've been talking about that in the outlooks here, so no real surprises there. So one more thing that we'll go ahead and take a look at for the weekend is looking at where this tropical system is now and just what exactly it's going to look like on simulated radar. Other than that, not really much of anything to talk about here. There's a couple areas of low pressure that could be watched for tropical development. Chances are low, of course, as we already know. And this is that little tropical feature just kind of spinning offshore and just throwing little rain bands onshore to the Gulf Coast here and there throughout the weekend here. So while the weather should be predominantly nice, be on watch for a few scattered showers here and there. If you're over towards maybe the bayou, over towards New Orleans, Lake Charles, maybe Biloxi and Mobile as well. But beyond that, I'm not really expecting anything major to come of that. One thing that I will make note of though before we go is looking at the weather pattern after this point we are going to see an increase in activity a little bit later as we get towards the back half of the week severe weather may come back into the equation here 
as we get towards the middle of the month things do look like they try to spice back up a bit based on the troughing that you see for example this right here this is what's causing the cool temperatures but it's really these troughs right here that i'm going to be watching over the rest of the week to see if we end up getting severe weather we'll get more details on that probably monday i would say but in any case though hope you guys enjoy your friday and the rest of your weekend we'll have a tropical out uh, update or outlook can't get the two right probably have a tropical outlook maybe tomorrow maybe sunday we'll see how things pan out from that point that being said appreciate you guys being here and i'll see you in the next video take care and have a good rest of your night